Okay. <laughs> right. Well, hopefully you can hear me over, over the uh, music. I did turn it down, but uh, still quite loud. Anyway, I did, I did a, a little test video of this. It is a bit different to what I usually do. Just to see how it be received, and it seems to be received quite well, at least by standards of my channel. <laughs> and, uh, I, which is quite good because it means I can branch out to uh, something beyond all the space combat stuff. And uh, this is one of my favourite fight sims anyway. So I can do more of these if uh, these are well received. Anyway. Okay, there's a time limit on that screen. It's quiet on this one anyway. So uh, hopefully you heard what I was just saying. So this, this campaign uh, is a fictional one. Let's go slow though. Oh, is it all uh, switched again? This is uh, 1956, uh, kind of a fictional Third World War, I suppose, in Europe, with the Soviet Union looking to uh, take all of Germany. I don't know if they got any intentions on the rest of Europe in this one. But uh, that's all it is, you probably saw it in the blurb screen actually. Oh, it's on a uh, Gloucester Meteor and a nice sort of, uh, not usual sort of aircraft you have in flight sims. In fact, this whole time period didn't really cover in flight sims. Anyway, I'll see how this goes. I'll sort of uh, skip through the, a lot of the uh, in flight scenes because, of course, people have going on here to see all the uh, air combat and stuff blowing up of course that's the fun part so uh, keep that I think and it's grand operation yeah I'm a bit rusty on the grand operations of, uh, Poor luck whether I hit anything, but uh, as long as I got wingmen with me, they'll hit something. I'm, I'm much better in the yeah, anti air roll, I can uh, drop the bombs. If I hit something, great, then I just set the uh, wingman in and I'll cover them. Kind of, uh, yeah, combat's going to be uh, gun battles, dog fighting. Uh, does that need a folder? There's a folder down there somewhere. Somewhere right there. Anyway. So, uh, T-55 tanks. Things probably the targets. And there I've got, I've got MiG-15s, MiG-17s. Some old DX in there, they? they are in there somewhere. Then, uh, anyway, probably I've uh, read the mission objective right. Ah, destroy an enemy runway. Well, that's good. Should be able to hit that. As you can see by that, I, I do use this a lot. It's one of my favourite flight sims. And just one wingman. Pilot officer Alan Boddington. Right.
Expect that, but uh, listen, there now is not go head to head with uh, a MiG with those heavy caliber weapons. Oh well, I'll uh, I will uh, carry on with this. I'll uh, restart the campaign, of course, and then uh, carry on from there. And uh, so as I don't try and play chicken with uh, any more mix, that'll be uh, fine. I was doing pretty well to our sort of blew up there. So, with some uh, fun combat and uh, hopefully uh, this turns out to be quite popular anyway. <laughs> Despite the, yeah, uh, not the best start. A little embarrassing. I am better than that unless I'm get, getting old, but uh, I think that was bad luck. So, uh, yep, next I'll, uh, I'll uh, restart the campaign. It is a random mission site, so it will be a different mission in some way. So, uh, I'll do that probably uh, a few days' time. So, uh, see you then.